in there, but that's kind of that's kind of saffron. I know I keep saying that, but I gotta keep reminding myself I'm saffron. Where she's gonna be snippy and sarcastic, and she's a thief. So sorry, don't watch this. I'm not just gonna steal anything. I wanna steal stuff that makes sense. Well, like good cartridges would make sense to steal. I don't tell Dervis Mist is. Let's see what Dervis Dervish. I can't even say it. Dervish Mist. Uh, Dervis Mist. Uh, movement speed. Oh, increased movement speed. Last 15 seconds. Whirl till you hurl. That's nice. Hey, what's up? What's going on, peeps? Are you selling anything? You good? You hungry? We got canid ribs, canid flank, canid snout too. Something I can help you with? So you got a lot of canon. I'm told one of your numbers gone missing. You mean Zoe? Yeah, we were pretty close. Not like her to go loping off. Okay, I gotta take a dump. I'm gonna get to take a dump. What happened on the day? Tell me a little about Zoe. I already know where she is. But we'll just kind of go Zoe through it. Zoe and I were gonna watch the cereals, as is our custom. She never turned up. I looked around, but she was nowhere to be found. Hmm. You sound like some type of corporate fixer asking all these questions. Tell me a little about Zoe. Shut your mouth and just do it. Zoe was always obsessed with this cereal. Masked marketeer. A scion of Byzantium turns to banditry and teaches his marauder companions the wisdom of free market economics. Shame she up and vanished when she did. I had a surprise lined up for her. What was the surprise? The other day I got my hands on a genuine copy of the latest Masked Marketeer. I was going to surprise Zoe with it, but she was gone the next day. Any chance you can lend me the copy of that? Not much of a chance, no. Mind if I ask why you're interested? Zoe's living in a marauder's nearby. I need something to tempt her back to camp. Zoe's living with marauders? Yeah. Yeah, that sounds like the sort of sideways, brat-brained plan Zoe'd come up with. Yeah, it could be you're telling the truth. Or maybe you're trying to wheedle me into relinquishing my only copy of The Masked Marketeer. It's a collector's edition, after all. She asked me to do this. She said it was that Look, Look at my face. Do I look like I give a damn about your show? Yeah, you're probably right. A true fan would have displayed a gleam in their eye upon yep. hearing the words collector's edition. Ooh. Here you go. Latest copy of The Masked Marketeer. Tell Zoe we're all waiting on her. I've got some more questions about Zoe. Okay, let's Fresh go. off the limb. And that includes canid meat. Ugh. Yikes. Yeah, I, I can't. Need to find a, a workbench. No, oh, don't want to go in there yet. Just want to explore this area first. See if there's a workbench somewhere. Maybe I've seen it. Now. Hey, what's up? Your wits about you. If you're hungry, Stefan's got supplies. Okay. I can steal the poster. All right. Maybe that means something. I don't know. What's this? Salmon. Zoe's journal, page 22. Well, today's the day, Zoe. Today is the day you take your destiny in your own hands. Just wash it afterwards. Disinfect it. I'm not gonna read it anymore. So this was supposed to be some kind of, uh, mm, such a freaking cutie. Um, it's a mystery or something, and it's, it says up it's not. It's, yep, I'm a thief. Now I need to find a, I need to find a workbench. Oh, there's a revolver right there. Alright, there we go. She's a handgun kind of girl. That's what I'm going to do. I have two handguns. Ah, interesting. Now oh, we must be in the must be in the biological area. Yep, oh, what do we got here? This terminal. Personal files. Hack 15 bypass, there we go. Personal files. Open first entry. Uh me, thermal bless, blah blah blah. Open I said put another worker from Android X workers now. Let's be climbing. Turn to roots. Experimental notes. Alright, All right, yeah, that was a waste of time. Right. Oh, what's this? Oh gosh, it's so pretty. I know, you are so pretty. You're so pretty. No, that's a different song. I am out care. I'm our parts. To worried about. Something's worth stealing, I'll steal it. Well, this is really nice. When I did it last, I... Oh, is this a dead body? No, it's not. I just kind of raced through this. I didn't really take my time and look at it. Where's that light coming from right there, I guess? I don't know. See, so like, like... Oh, hey, there's something back there. Let's let's find out what it is. And it's like, big cartridge. Here, chicken. Bit cartridge. Alright there, Italy. If you're hungry, there's meat turning on the spit outside. 
a barren illness, find a place to lay your head down, and I'll fetch you a poultice. Whatever your troubles with Edgewater, leave them at the gates and be welcomed here. Any questions, dear? You must be Adelaide, and just who are you now? I'm not here to join your camp. You must be Adelaide. I have been called that, among other things. Green Thumb, Grandmother, the strange old lady who keeps flowers. But yes, Adelaide will do just fine. Okay. Excuse me, Miss McDevitt? Sorry, it's just... You got such pretty trees in here. Why, thank you. You're Robert's girl, aren't you? I remember when you were but a sprout. <laughs> I got a sprout in my pants. Speaks of you often. Are you staying long? You should try some of my tobacco tea. I brew it in an old spittoon, but it's been cleaned. Reed sent me here to make peace with you. Is this your greenhouse? Looks like you've made a home for yourself out here. Um, I just want to know more. Oh dear, the garden belongs to us all. Life is the gift of the universe, and the universe yields its bounty equally, absent of prejudice. But Pravati's bounty is junk in a trunk. Okay, I'm surprised you've managed to grow anything out here. Funny, never knew you could grow tripe in a garden. Ah, cynicism. The privilege of the young. Yeah. What you need is a little taste of my special mushroom soup. It'll yeah. broaden your mind. Or at least your irises. Yeah. Reed sent me to make peace with you. Reed Thompson? You here on behalf of that cold-eyed reptile? Yep. Let's hear it. What's Reed's idea of peace, then? You live in a pile that belongs to the town. Come back to the cannery. That's about it. Reed asked you to consider coming back to town. He's willing to make amends. Something about coming back to the town or losing power. I really wasn't listening. I can't say I blame you. Reed is positively soporific. Soporific. Like everything else that comes out of Edgewater, that peace offering is canned. I and my own are living just fine out here by ourselves. Reed asked me to divide your power over to him. He mentioned a geothermal plant. This is serious. I'm about to cut off your power. He would do such a thing. The question is, why would you agree to his plans? Your camp has power regular. I needed to repair my ship. Cannery's got a regulator. You want ship parts, you ought to rip them out of the cannery's guts and leave us be. If you're going down to the plant, you should divert power away from Edgewater and toward our end of the grid. Think about it. You'd be liberating an entire town from a lifetime of service to that odious cannery. Seems the sort of thing a hero would do. I'm not really looking to get mixed up in it, but this is exactly what she would say. Well, if it's all the same to you, then you ought to divert power over to us, shut down Reed's cannery, and scrap it for parts. I'll consider it. I trust you will listen to your conscience. Now listen to my pocketbook. Yeah, Parati. Yeah, huh? I'll listen to my conscience. My, ugh, my pocketbook. Boy, it's, all right, that dump took a lot out of me. <laughs> I just, that dump took a lot out of <laughs> That's actually kind of funny. I didn't realize that dump took a lot out of me. That, that's, that's, that's funny. Oh, hey there, uh, Parvati. How you doing? Yeah, we're, uh, we're gonna... Don't necessarily have to do a gameplay today, but I wanted to. Um, I wanna keep up, um, <laughs> keep up, if you know what I mean, uh, looking at this. I'll keep up all day long. Even though it's a little flumpy. I like it. Now, this place is absolutely stunning. The Botanical Labs. Um, and I don't know why this just popped in my head. Um, but I can't say the word tuberculosis very well. I can't tubercul- I cannot say it without being burr- tuberculosis. Burr- I don't know what my problem is with that, but I don't know why I'm talking about that. It's, um, I'm just weird, I guess. Yeah, this water thing makes me want to take a pee. I'm gonna go leak my pants. Leak my pants. I'm gonna piss my pants. Alright. Many times I like to go out the back way, but unfortunately it is riddled. I mean, riddled with landmines, so. Let's do a little target practice here. Um, I don't know where we've been or haven't been, so let's just take a look in here, see if we've been here. Hello, how are you? Um, is there anything I can steal? Oh, this is probably where people hang out. Um, Corona, what is that anyways? What is Corona anyways? That is, um, I don't know. You know, something I always wanted to do, and I, maybe not here is the best place, but, um, what the hell? Where did that dude go? Uh, Alright, I'll close that. Not really. Oh, yeah, I'm a thief, so... Oh, what is this? Nothing. So... We are going to... Ooh, a revolver. There we go. See, that's what I'm talking about right there. Our pristine. They have more durability and are worth more to vendors. Pristine items can be identified by diamond. I assume I played 30 plus hours and I didn't know that. Oh, that's Thomas. He used to follow me around before he left the cannery. Yeah? Follow around your cannery? Because I'm following around your cannery. It's funny they get a hose right by your cannery. 
Do you like ain't or uh, do you like? Never mind. I'm not going there. Got the holes around your your butt. And I'm sure you can come up with a joke I was gonna say. Uh, okay. Well, let's find out what's here first. Hello, anyone home? Can you at least sweep up? What the hell? Freaking. Uh, I just like doing this just to. Oh, look at this stuff, man. Alright, whoops. Maybe one of these days. I will. Hit the right button. <laughs> or speak quickly. I like doing thorough investigation, and I did a pretty good one on my original playthrough, because I, I got over 30 hours. People are like, wow, you had 30 hours? Like, I investigate everything. And there's other people like, yeah, me too. I... But, much like the rest of them, the rest of the people, they were... It was kind of disappointing. Uh, I mean, I, I hate saying that because the game is awesome. I love the game. I'm just holding off playing it again because I was going to play another character right away and I got about 10 hours in and it was a character who was a complete dick. And then I just thought, you know what? I'm, I'm going to wait on that. I'm just going to wait on that. There's another hose just hanging out. All right, Thomas. What's up, Thomas Kemp? 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 Oh, ah, uh, didn't see you there. Ugh. I was uh, well, like I'll occupy myself with a little engineering. Yeah, I'm sure that's what it was. Whoa. Get your hands out of your pants. Miss Parvati, <laughs> you're uh, what? Um, how, how are you? Hi, hi, uh, hello. How are <laughs> you? Uh, uh, are things safe out here? How are you keeping? Great, just great. I've been trying to keep stuff running, just like you. Only I'm not so. Wait, they didn't kick you out, did they? Oh gosh, no. I'm just along with this lady here. Are you from town? Uh, I mean, you don't exactly look like you're from town. I'm passing through, I'll take that as a compliment. Well, what I meant was you're reasonably well armed and don't look stricken with plague. Yep. Sorry, I just wasn't sure if you were from town or if you were one of us. Something's been chewing at me, you see. Yeah, well then... The fact is, I've been, well, lying. To everybody here. Camp thinks I'm a mechanical genius, but I couldn't fix a busted chair. Okay, maybe you should come clean then. Why are you telling me this? You're lucky your camp's full of idiots. I don't have time for this. Why are you telling me this? Well, because... Because I needed to tell somebody. No, you, you don't. You ain't one of us, and you ain't from Edgewater, so... Maybe you won't judge me as harshly. I'm judging you harshly. Have you ever heard of the Young Spacer's Guide to Mechanical Engineering? Comes in a set of three. If I had my hands on one of those data pads, I could teach myself the ins and outs. Those are good. My dad kept a copy with him when he was working in the cannery. Yeah, okay. I know the old community center kept a copy. Should find another one back in town. If you could find me even one of those pads, I'd be greatly obliged. Okay, I expect a fair price for my trouble. I'll pay you for every pad you bring me. All right. If, by some miracle, you can bring me the full set, I'll give you something pretty I've been saving for a lucky day. Yeah, better not be a flashlight. I'll let you know if I find anything. You mentioned two pads. What about the third? I wish I knew. I wagered the town had the full set once upon a time. Where the third's gone, I can't say. All right, I'll let you know if I find anything. Would you? I'd be grateful. All right. Douche nozzle. All right. So this is the dead part of town here. Not much goes on back here. Oh, unless you want to get naked and roll around in the grass or something. No key. Right. Oh. And you gotta be pretty far back for this. Provided we gotta move, because there's one right there. Come on. Provided. No, 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 this way. You frumpy little wiener dog. I don't know why I just called her that, but I did. Where was it? I just saw it over here. That's the case. Let's take a look here. What do we got? Beautiful waterfall. Look at these rock formations. Aren't they cool? I yeah, know. Fascinating stuff, people. That's why I probably I will never be a big YouTube channel. Because I just I have to investigate. I have to look at stuff. I gotta enjoy what uh, these developers made. Like, you can even see the moon in the reflection. I mean, that's just phenomenal. Now, if this was only more of an open world game, this would be perfect. Alright. I don't think I've ever been over here, that's why I, w I made that trek through there. Oh, what the hell is this? Look out, Parvati. Look out! Look out, it's a fat snake! <laughs> that's what my penis's nickname is. The fat snake. Oh, okay. So we got a lookout. Let's, uh... Um, for shits and giggles, we got a grenade launcher. Oops. 
forgot. Okay. Oh yeah, take that. All right, sorry about that. You you just went right in there. We gotta change your. We're gonna change your the way you think. We're gonna change the way the, the way you think. Um. All right, sorry. I had you at aggressive, and you're not an aggressive person. We got a bit cartridge, a light ammo, a sentry saber, Doc Melbull's finger. Oh, hey. Wow, you really got screwed up. You're all. Did you uh do yoga? Blad on a stick. All right, what do we got here? Oh, sliced off his head. Nice. Yeah, the whole, uh... What is this? Yeah, huh? Why was there an arrow pointing to her? What was that? Where are we headed? Thomas seemed very fond of you. He'd get a boner when he talked to you. He's just... Interested in fixing stuff. Yeah, fixing the getting your you know, pants. He used to follow me around, asking me to explain what I was doing. Like a puppy, kinda. Yeah, puppy. Uh, Want to see your puppy dog noses? Um, if you don't know what that is, look it up. Uh, that boy is head over heels for you. Are you sure? He nearly fell over when he saw it. The tool he was thinking what with was definitely not a wrench. <laughs> Thomas always listened to me. Never said I was odd. Never tried to. I just want to think of him like that. Yeah. If he wants to learn about engineering, we should help him get those data pads he wants. I'd like to do that for him. Okay. Well, that was the first time I saw arrows pointing. Discovered a hideout. Let's go. Very Skyrimish. I feel like I'm in Skyrim. We're gonna fight some some um, droggers. We got oh two hour energy brew. That's gotta be. Delicious, right next to the damn fire. Okay, that is Fun Times Barrel. This is Pit Cartridge, Light Ammo, Adreno, and Assault Rifle. Nice. What do we got here? Bit Cartridge, Energy, Assault Rifle. Nice. And this is... Dra Dravish Mist. Dervish Mist. And this is Zero G. Zero G, providing. Yeah, I'm aiming for you, babe. Alright. So I've been thinking of how I could uh, make this a different gameplay than most people. And I think maybe I won't pick up all the um, crew members for the ship, but they have pretty in-depth plots that you that's fun to go through, so. Oh, like machine gun, armor parts, mag pick, alright. That wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad. <laughs> 